How's it going everyone? Welcome to another reaction and today's a special day. It's May the 4th. It's Star Wars Day and your boy Eco, he just dropped a new single called The Mandalorian and I have high hopes for this one because whenever he talks about comic books or Star Wars and stuff like that he just snaps. I'm really excited to see what he has going for this one. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Already with the Mandalorian soundtrack as a sample. Yeah, it's been a real complicated profession. Hard to trust when you don't have no people's intentions. Keep it independent. When they try to stop, you say, nah, homie, this is the way. Hey, yeah, so legit. OG, call me Boba Fett. You a little Padawan kid. Taking notes and sit. I hold my head up high. First of all, I thought it was just the starting, but no, the whole beat is incorporating the Mandalorian soundtrack, which is amazing for one, because the beat is amazing. I'm curious, is he gonna get like claimed or striked for this? I, I don't know. Maybe he won't? I'm curious about that, but like so far this is good. There's that. Let's move on. Repping for these comic nerds, cosplayers, gamer kids, movie nuts, what a world. Yeah, it's used to think we don't exist, right? And now it's cool to like the things we always did, right? Oh, oh okay, I, I see what he did there, you know, I felt this. It, back in the day, people would get bullied for like reading comic books or being a movie nerd and all. Haha, <laughs> you're a nerd, you, you get bullied for that shit. And uh, now, suddenly, talking about movies, knowing all about them, reading comic books and all, it's just like, Everyone does it, all the celebrities and all. It's not nerdy anymore. Now that it's making the money, it's like super popular and stuff. I see what he's doing here. I would be mad, but if I think about it twice, I'm just happy that we're getting all this dope content. So why just keep it cool, honey, bunny, deadly like I'm... There again, he explained it pretty well there. He's just happy that we're getting all this content because now it's so popular that people actually invest into this world of comic books and movies and fictional characters and so on. When I'm playing in Desert the only time I play by rules in a different lane, I've been doing my thing, but just like Rocket, y'all been confusing me for Rabbit. Stop it. Rocket Rabbit, that's a Marvel line there because everyone thinks Rocket the Raccoon. Uh, Thor calls him a rabbit. Rabbit is correct and clearly the smartest among them. I roll in solo, I'm stealing the show, that's Donald Glover. I pull the crossbow like Chewie and Elsa will for cover. The bounty hunter in the game with these raps. I just get the puck, check the five, take them out, secure the bag. I love it when he does that stuff with the beat and the pauses. I, I, I just like it. I don't know why. It, it's just something. It's when you least expect it. You think he's going to go into the fast verse, but he'll just pull a fast one on you. Yeah. Midichlorians course through the veins. I don't know what that means. The short keep it vague. Want to stop me? It's obvious you're insane. If you're thinking that you ever go hit me with Stormtrooper aim. Yeah, they calling me Death Star. I'm about to blow up. I may be cheap, but I'm also deadly. That's Baby Yoda. I'm in the booth. Give me time to reshoot. Now I'm going to show you why they scared of me like Vader at the end of Rogue One. Oh, Vader at the end of Rogue One. Okay, okay, yeah. That scene in Rogue One, just like, oh my god. That was... Like the most violent we've seen Darth Vader, actually, when you think about it. He just went into a ship and killed everyone. Everyone. Just 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 one man army just destroyed everything. Ugh. Hey, there ain't a beat I think I couldn't rip through. It's like a power this microphone up a kyber crystal. Fire missiles out the falcon in this battle, and I'm about to take a photo of this universe. Call me John Favreau. Yeah. The light, but I'm really been feeling the dark entice me. I might go psycho, Kylo Palpatine, Dark Fallen Snow. I'm grabbing a mic and thinking they got the skill. Step up and try me. I don't gotta be a fucking Jedi to force a choke. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to be a fucking Jedi to force a choke. I like that. I like that. I think I found the droids you're looking for Will be a comic con with all my people Jordan Keats I'm like the Kevin Smith the rap Getting paid to tour Talk about the shit I love And do it independently So love the anime Marvel Your favorite shows in DC Anything to make you feel An escape from the stress He shouted out the anime manga gang Let's go Do your thing Don't be afraid to be yourself Believe me They can never hurt you With the best star armor fit Yeah I've been paying all these dues Amateurs, you couldn't last a day up in my shoes Still there's people who've been praying that I lose But like Mando's helmet, I will not be removed, no I'm going Cara Dune, locked and loaded 
Training like I'm Luke, always stay devoted, yeah. Waiting for the Mandalorian season two to drop. Until then, I've spoken. That's a Mandalorian TV show thing. If you haven't watched it yet, you should. It's really good. I'm surprised the beat actually had a lot of like the soundtrack from the Mandalorian just baked into it with the sample. It's straightforward, but that's what it is. It's showing love to the culture, to Star Wars, to the series. It's like a tribute, and I like it. Uh, this was dope. This is special. This is for May the 4th. Hell yeah. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below of the song and if you have any feedback for what I should do in my reactions further on just let me know and I'll see what I can do anyways thanks for watching to the two of you that are actually watching this and see you next time peace